hello guys so welcome to this ugo host tutorial so regarding the all the questions i have um ugo host on my youtube channel i decided to create a series another series of the new ugo host platform so guys this will cover everything you need to know about the new ugo host platform and how to purchase a domain name how to buy a web host and how to log into your account create an account go to cpanel and stuff you have there now if you are joining or watching for the first time or you are coming across my youtube channel for the first time my name is victor i'm your brother your friend and your hobo guy yes my name is victor and this is victory design i create content on web design and teach you how to manage website make money from website and do a lot more from the web design niche now on this video i want to teach you how to get started with the Ugo host platform so this is the Ugo host tutorial that teaches you how to get started with the Ugo host platform now if you're using the Google's platform for the first time that means you want to purchase a domain name buy a web host and then host your website okay the first step to do the first thing you want to do is to come to the platform and search if your domain name is correct so i'm going to check for a domain name that i don't even have um, i don't even have any idea okay let me just do v3 design v3 design tutorial dot com dot ng now after searching for the domain after typing the domain name you want to click on search now go host is going to search and preload and see if you have um if there is anything like that available or if the name is available so still searching now it's available now dot com dot ng was one two before on my old video currently it is now one three so hundred naira has been added to it now once you see that the name is actually available for you you're going to click on add to cart now once you add that to cart you're going to go upward look for um web hosting so i think okay not not wordpress hosting even though you are using wordpress guys i prefer you just go for web hosting directly so let's go to the linux hosting and then see how the price is and then you choose a very good one for your website now it depends on the website you are building if you are building a basic website it's better you just go with this 1000 a um a month that will be 12000 per year if you are building a powerful website a more powerful website it would be better if you go for this depending on how powerful the website is going to be but if you are building just a local broker bank the normal site that doesn't allow regular interaction or a normal business website i think you should go for this one it's way cheaper and it's easy to maintain so you, you have a, about six gig space 30 gig bandwidth 10 subdomain two add-on domains free dot ng domain free ssl and um free, unlimited email unlimited database now for this free dot ng domain you cannot get it directly like if you are if you purchase another name you cannot get it directly. All you have to do to get this dot free dot um this free dot ng domain is to purchase that place. The first part which we did it dot com dot ng domain. You just buy dot ng domain and then you link it to this web host and then you are very good to go. So now, once you select this, click on order now. It will try to synchronize your domain name and the web host together. Now, once you synchronize your domain name and web host together, it's going to take you to a payment part. Now, on the payment part, you will have to create an account and once you create an account before you can actually pay so i'm going to take you to my account so you can see what i'm talking about so let me copy the domain name here okay i'm going to go back to my account so now guys this is actually my account okay this is my account guys not my main account actually this is an account i created for affiliation so i'm going to click on domains So I, I created this account due to the fact that I needed something um, and uh, to affiliate with um, what was it called with Google Host. So that's why I created this account, edupreparty.com. Now the affiliation is actually working fine, guys. It's actually working fine. So now once you're done with that, you're going to come to your dashboard after making your payment. Your username, your link, and everything will be given to you in the, when where you when you make your payment. Now if you come to your dashboard, you're going to see everything here the number of hosts you actually services you have your domain name your invoice your ticket you have to see, you see everything here so if you want to log into your c panel you're going to assess that through your services you want to see your domain name check for ssl and that stuff you're going to see them from this area so now some of you said you have issue um 
with your account counseling what's it called what, what did that guy said he said you he has issue canceling uh his payment plan so all you just have to do is to click on open ticket and then re report your uh, issue with them you can also do it yourself for your uh invoice also goals have this new um function or this new platform or this new method of pay making payment on your account so for example if you want to renew your or your website and you just have the money now but you don't want to renew it as soon as possible you just want to keep the money on your account you can make use of this add fund option and then you can credit your account and the money is going to be inside now once that is done you will then from your um service part log into your c panel and then you'll be welcome with your c panel so guys that's how you can actually so this is the amount you can credit and add fund to your account this is how this is the beginning part of go host which you can buy domain name purchase a web hosting and then log into your cpanel i have another video on cpanel i have a lot of video on go host if i just go to my youtube channel as you can see there are a lot of videos on go host on my channel so you can check for any of them that suits you and then you find video i also did a new video today on the new go cpanel you can actually assess that from that part the every other thing you need in building your website are all on the cpanel the next video i'm going to be doing now is a, a video on how to install wordpress on google host so if you have not subscribed please hit the subscribe button like this video follow me and then we'll, i'll see you on my next video i guess this explains everything you need to do in purchasing a domain name buying a web host checking your account dashboard and even affiliating so in affiliation if you click on affiliate if you want to also make money through Google Host, you click on affiliate, you'll see where you can actually copy your referral link and then give it to people to purchase domain name from Google Host. So 315 clicks, you have three sign up and that amounts to 200, 2,700. So guys, this is how so you can keep promoting your link. It as long as I actually share this link on um website or video. So I, I think I'm gonna resume that now. So guys, this is how you can actually make money. The conversion rate is low because everyone can just go to gohost.com but to some people they still just want to click on your link and buy through your link so i have no extra cost for them guys so that's it so guys i think that i've explained a lot that you need to or almost everything you need to know on the google host platform so i think okay everything is complete please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and i will see you on my next video have a nice day guys bye